Have you ever encountered such an annoying thing? You need to edit a Word document for work or any other reason, but only to find that editing is restricted and you are locked outside of the door. But you really need to make some edits, so you try to enter the password, which is not easy to guess, right? Of course. After failing too many times, you completely have no idea what to do. So, is there really no way out? Definitely not. Today in this video, I will offer you some remedies. Want to check out what they are exactly? Now, please give a thumbs up and subscribe to us, and then continue your watching. Method 1. Renaming File Extension Step 1. Rename the extension from .docx to .zip and click Yes to confirm the alteration. Step 2. Now open the zip file with Windows Explorer. Step 3. Click on the Word folder and find the file named settings.xml and delete it from the list. After that, change the file extension back to .docx and you should now be able to edit the Word file. However, there exist some limitations. For example, this method is not applicable to all versions of Word. It works for my Word 2019, but not for my friend's Word 2016. Method two, saving the Word document as RTF text. Step one, open your restricted Word document. Click on File, Save As. In the new Save As window, choose star.rtf as the file type. Step two, close your original work document and the new star.rtf file. Then open the RTF file with Notepad. Step three, press Control plus F at the same time. Find password hash in the text and replace with no password. Step four, save your operation and close the Notepad. Open the RTF file again with your Word program. Step five, go to Review, Restrict Editing, Stop Protection. Uncheck all the boxes on the right panel. Done, the editing restriction on your Word has been removed successfully now. But as you can see, this method requires too many steps and a minor slip would give birth to a total failure. Now, we have talked about two methods renaming file extension and saving the Word document as RTF text. However, it's disappointing that neither of them is time-saving or easy to operate enough to solve our problem. But don't worry, there is still another method to get us out of trouble effectively at the top speed. Passbar for Word. Since I have already downloaded it to the computer, next I will show you how to use it directly. Step 1. Open Passbar for Word on your computer and select the Remove Restrictions. Step 2. Import the restricted Word file into the program by clicking on the Select a File option and browsing for the file. Step 3. Now click on the Remove button to allow the program to begin removing the restriction. In a few seconds, all restrictions will be removed and the document will be editable. Remove editing restrictions on Word document in just a few seconds with a 100% success rate. Passbar for Word is undoubtedly a lifesaver. If you want to have a try, just click the download link below in the description for this video and in just a blink of an eye, your problem will be solved. Well, this is all for today's video. I hope I've helped you and thanks very much for watching. If you have any advice or questions about this video, or any other topics you want to see in the next video, please feel free to let your voice out in the comments area below. Okay, see you next time.